Today I'm going to show you six ways that China could defeat the United States in a war and how they are already doing just that. Is the United States in a war with China? Well, not a physical military war, no. However, once you watch this video, you will see that the two countries are already at war in so many different ways that you can't come to any other conclusion. Okay, let's get into it. The first three advantages China has over the United States are all military related. But stick around until the end, and I'm going to show you the number one weapon China has that most people don't even think about. Number one is their numbers. China currently has 2,185,000 troops in its military, as opposed to the United States 1,388,100. These numbers are the number of active duty personnel both countries have reported to the International Institute for Strategic Studies. Now this might seem like a huge advantage on paper, but given the strategic alliances both countries have, these numbers can be evened up pretty quickly. The NATO group as a whole report 3.3 million troops altogether, so it seems pretty clear that in the event of an actual war, China would still need the help of allies, but either way, you can see that both of these militaries possess tremendous power, and a conflict between the two superpowers would most likely end with massive casualties. Okay, on to number two, their navy. China now boasts the largest navy in the world. China reports that they currently possess approximately 730 warships as opposed to the United States 484. Now, these are simply the sheer number of ships both countries possess, but according to the aviation defense universe, when you factor in technology, personnel on board these vessels, helicopters, aircraft aboard carriers, etc., the United States is still the most powerful navy on the planet. Once again, it looks like the United States holds a slight advantage here, especially once you add all of the NATO resources to a potential conflict, but you can see how mass casualties would most likely occur. Okay, on to number three. And don't forget to stick around till the end for the big one that I bet you haven't thought about. Okay, number three is hypersonic missiles. Now this is a technology the United States is way behind in. U.S. intelligence reports that China has the world's largest amount of hypersonic missiles, which can fly at speeds five times the speed of sound and are almost impossible to detect or defend against. The United States currently doesn't possess any of these weapons, so this would be a huge advantage if a military conflict were to break out between these two superpowers. Okay, that's all we're going to discuss pertaining to the actual military. The last three things on our list, and especially the last one, are far more powerful than any of the things we've talked about so far, so keep watching with me here. Okay, number four. This list wouldn't be complete without talking about the spy balloon that flew all the way across the United States a few weeks ago. Now, I wouldn't necessarily say this is an advantage China has, however it does send a message that China can in fact reach the continental United States and did just that with this balloon. So that's about all I'm going to say about that. Now let's talk about a controversial one. Number five, COVID. Now from what I have seen, it has never been proven that COVID was leaked from a lab in Wuhan, China, and this may or may not be the case. But the alternative theory that scientists have come up with is that this virus jumped from bats located in caves in Wuhan onto other animals then eventually transmitted to humans. So, no matter which theory you choose to believe, either way, this deadly virus originated in or around Wuhan, China, whether intentionally or unintentionally. Since there's no solid proof for either theory, we will move on to number six, which is the most powerful weapon China potentially has over the United States no matter how you look at it. But before we get to number six, if you're liking this video so far, please give it a thumbs up and consider subscribing to my channel. Thank you very much. Okay, so number six. 
The single most powerful weapon China has against the United States that we have no answer for is TikTok. But not for the reason you may think. You see, TikTok has been accused of sending user information to the Communist Party of China since the app is owned by ByteDance, the Chinese company, and this may or may not be true. What I will say about it is either way, this is not the biggest threat about TikTok. Now currently, the United States is considering a nationwide ban of TikTok based on the argument that the Chinese Communist Party could at any time request user data from Americans and TikTok would have to hand it over based on the way the laws in China are written and this may be true and I can see why people would be upset over this. What I will say though is I'm a very avid student of all social media and I can tell you that from what I can tell TikTok doesn't grab any more information from its users than the meta platforms Facebook and Instagram do. TikTok simply has ties to China and potentially its government. What I will say is based upon my own studies of TikTok, what I have found could crush the United States from within almost immediately. You see, there are dozens and dozens of content creators across YouTube, Instagram, Facebook, and other platforms who are all saying the same thing. That as soon as they start talking about certain topics on the TikTok platform, their views will go from hundreds of thousands to just a few hundred almost immediately. This is called shadow banning, and all platforms do it. However, if you think about this for a moment, it all makes sense. If the TikTok algorithm is set up to censor certain content down to nothing, then that means it can also feed other types of content into millions of people's for you page on TikTok. This means that at any point in time, the Communist Party of China could order the engineers of TikTok to alter the algorithm to push out anti-American content in the United States, as well as promote the Chinese propaganda to those same consumers inside of the United States. Now, if you don't believe this would open up the door to an invasion of China, just take a look at these numbers. Right now in the United States, there are 150 million users on the TikTok platform. Now, with a population of 332 million people, that means that 45.18% of all the United States citizens are currently using TikTok, which also means that if the scenario I just described ever happened, you can see how the United States would implode from within. This country is already so divided for various reasons that it would be so easy to influence a large percentage of the population by simply changing the algorithm of TikTok suddenly. This, in my opinion, is the single biggest threat China poses over the United States that is far greater than any military strengths it may have. If you like this video, please consider subscribing to my channel if you haven't done so already. And hit the thumbs up button. That tells YouTube to push this video out to more people. Did you know that 90% of people that watch YouTube videos aren't subscribed to that person's channel? That really helps YouTube know what videos you like to watch when you hit the subscribe button and the thumbs up button. So it's always a good idea to do that. Please stay tuned for the next video that I think you just might enjoy. And thanks for watching.